this photograph is uh, something that fools people a lot because it looks like a photograph of a newly completed city hall. But if you look at it carefully, it's actually an architectural uh, model. I've been the city archivist now for 15 years. When you think of an archives, you should always think of the word permanent, permanent and historically valuable materials. The good fortune that we have in the city of Dallas is that we have a very robust records management program. The responsibility for taking care of the archives is an awesome one. Uh, I will definitely say that but it is also uh, a pure pleasure to be able to try to uncover things or help people uh, who are looking for certain kinds of things, as, especially if they're visual materials. This is actually the earliest minutes, in fact, the earliest records we have of Dallas City Government, uh, the Dallas City Council, but contained in it are some very interesting things that have been pasted into the margins and into the end pages of this thing election notice from 1871, which is one of the elections that uh, generated the funds to bring the first train to Dallas. Uh, this is probably one of the two most important things that happened in Dallas history, whether they're a, a map or an architectural plan or design or even a photograph of some kind. Um, as long as it has a city government connection, we probably have something on it.